The meetings of the Syrian-Iraqi-Iranian Joint Committee was inaugurated this Wednesday morning in Damascus at the Ministry of Justice and with presence of Iran's Vice President of Judiciary for International Affairs, Mr. Kadim Garibabadi. The three delegations discussed the mechanism to finalize a memorandum of understanding in order to follow up on the terrorist crimes committed in the three countries and prosecute their perpetrators. We all know that in addition to the military terrorism and economic terrorism that is being waged against Syria, Iran and Iraq, there is another type of terrorism that has emerged recently, which is the legal war that is being waged against these countries that had to come together to form a tripartite judicial committee to work and investigate legal matters. The Iraqi delegation headed by Judge Shlaith Jabir Hamza emphasized that the work of the trilateral committee is very important for the exchange of information between the three countries in order to combat terrorism, whether at the level of the states or the terrorist groups. This tripartite meeting is very important to exchange information and lay the foundations for developing a new judicial cooperation mechanism. The assassination of Commander Qasem Soleimani is a terrorist crime by all standards, and we are exchanging related information with the Iranians. We have several topics to discuss in regards to combating terrorism. This meeting will be followed by other meetings to sign memorandums of understanding in order to deepen ties of judicial cooperation. The Iranian delegation, along with members of the Syrian-Iranian Parliamentary Friendship Association, discussed with the Syrian Parliament Speaker, Hamoud al-Sabbagh, the ways to consolidate parliamentary relations between both countries and the latest Israeli terrorist attack on the Iranian embassy in Damascus. I emphasize with the Parliament Speaker the strong strategic relations that unite the two countries which have defeated the conspiracies of global arrogance. The Zionist regime targeted our diplomatic mission in Damascus in a coward terrorist attack, and the response of the Islamic Republic of Iran to the crime of the Zionist entity was in accordance with the Charter of the United Nations and within the framework of self-defense. Gharib Abadi and the judicial delegation met with the Syrian Minister of Foreign Affairs and discussed the importance of presenting the joint judicial efforts of the three countries to the international organizations. The Islamic Republic of Iran is playing a vital role in combating terrorism in the region, along with the countries that have suffered from the impacts of this notorious phenomenon. Ibrahim Wahdi, Press TV, Damascus.